We thanks. It's been hard for cities to clear the streets with one snowstorm after another. A Goshen issued an emergency parking order asking people to park on the even number side of the street on even days and on the so odd side of the street on odd days. But WSBT's Ed Ernstis reports not everyone is cooperating. Each weekday this week, Goshen Street crews will be out in force plowing and removing snow. With the emergency snow parking order in effect, they'll plow one side of the street and come back the next day to take care of the other side. Those who have heard of the order agree that's the way to keep streets clear. I think they're doing the best that they can um, to try and make the streets drivable, um, and they're trying to get ahead of the problem. It's been a rough winter, and we don't know how much more snow is coming, and we have to be able to prepare for whatever comes. We absolutely have to do it to get the snow pushed back because of more snow that's coming. Unfortunately, the city says it has not gotten the cooperation from some folks to move their cars. The mayor says it's more than a little disconcerting in the fact that the city has tried a number of different ways to get the word out about the emergency parking ban, and yet it appears that there are those here who are ignoring it. And we don't know if they just haven't heard about it or if they just don't care. The city has a towing ordinance on the books, but it's limited by state statute on how much notice must be given before you tow. Plus, it's required to post signs on every street ahead of time, notifying people about the plan to tow. Right now, we do have cars on both sides of the street, and the way the ordinance is written, we can't just immediately tow them. We're trying to get neighbors to talk to neighbors and get serious about moving their cars. We got to help them, and they got to do the best that they can, too, to try to keep the roads as clear as possible. Ernst, this WSBT Channel 22 News. Well, Goshen City workers are knocking on doors to find owners of the cars to get them moved. If streets can't be adequately plowed and more snow falls, it could be harder for emergency traffic to get through.